lockout, and it's easy to see why. Though her promoter, Bob Arum, was once opposed to women's boxing, he now features St. John on the undercard of Oscar De La Hoya fights. Do you think Bob has you on that undercard because of his respect for you as a boxer or because of how you look? <laughs> well, certainly, I, I really find it hard to believe it's because he respects me as a boxer. The real drama is whether she's going to get hit in that gorgeous puss of hers, uh, or whether she's going to be able to avoid taking any punishment. I'm sure his main incentive was my looks, that he could market. In order to put herself through school at Cal State Northridge, where she earned a BA in psychology, St. John appeared on calendars and posters for Playboy. She says she dislikes modeling and acting, but she couldn't say no when Playboy magazine decided to feature her on its upcoming November cover. But is this the kind of exposure that will cause her to be taken more or less seriously by fight fans? People, my critics are never going to take me seriously. There's nothing I can do. I could fight, you know, the world's greatest female fighter out there, and they're still not going to take me seriously. It's really hard to get, especially men, to take her seriously because of the way she looks. Now, men can view St. John through an entirely different lens, one that gives new meaning to the term sweet science. Given the choice by Playboy, St. John chose to be photographed inside the ropes rather than between the sheets, proving that you can take the playmate out of the gym, but you can't take the gym out of the playmate. I said, oh, no, no, I want the world to know what I am and what I do, because I am a fighter first and foremost. I am not a Playboy model who fights for top rank. I am a top rank fighter who posed for Playboy, and that's what I want the world to know. St. John, who makes 25 grand per bout, says Playboy paid her three times that much. And now that the naked truth has been revealed, Hollywood wants its piece of the pie. Are we afraid of a little sweat? No, I'm afraid of that left hook. She recently appeared on The Tonight Show. Interesting, since she's been trying to get Jay Leno's attention for two years. I'll do anything to get people to buy my fight. If it's going to be to pose for Playboy or do Pacific Blue or anything that makes them pay attention to female fighting, um, I don't care how they get there as long as they get there, you know? And if I can bring that exposure to women, then it'll just make the sport grow. Take it from Mia. It's all about exposure. Reporting from Van Nuys, California, I'm Mark Schwartz, ESPN. Mark, thanks. I only watch SportsCenter for the article.